Hi, good evening, everyone. Uh, we are going to start today's session now. Good evening, sir. So, great. Group number six. Um, so, um, I, I want you to revise your fundamental rights given in Indian Constitution, Article 12 to 35, but rest of the important point that we are going to learn. Great, so uh, yeah, today uh, you will figure out more stuff for your competition. Okay, so please remember, this is the format. Okay, uh, first of all, you know, when uh, you do your research work and all, okay, so before that, you know, how to, you know, draft your memorial, because memorial is very important. So these are the important points that I'm going to tell you, okay. So in case if you have any kind of question, please feel free to discuss. So at the top, you, you'll write because uh, uh, you, you're participating for the first time. So um, the first thing in your memorial, you, what do you have, you have, you have to write is school name and then your group number. Okay, so remember your group number is six and you have to write your school name. After that, here it is written before the Honorable High Code of New Delhi, but the case law which I'm going to share with you, that requires Supreme Code of India. So please remember everyone, you have to write what before the honorable supreme code of india okay in case you will have any kind of question please do ask now appeal number so it can be imaginary because you know you're actually it's a moot code so you can take and instead of 2019 you can make it 2021 this is one example so you you can you can take you know maybe appeal number 001 it's totally up to you maybe 002 and after that you can write down 2021 under the article now we, we we have learned you know article so don't write two two seven because you need to first understand your case law after that you can write uh that case law is matching with which you know article so accordingly you, you need to write but but you, you can't write two two seven because is this is one example of constitution of india okay 1950 in the matter of applicant so you you'll find in your case law the name of the applicant and the respondent okay so anyone is having any doubt related to this no sir i'm talking about memorial that you will have to prepare Okay, don't worry, every, on every step, I'm there to help you. So don't you think how it will happen, who is going to help? Okay, so this is my first mood code. So see, this is not mock code, this is mood code. Generally, it, mood codes are only for law students, but why we are bringing as it is, so that you will have complete knowledge of it. Okay. Now, after that, you know, 
in the matter of maybe on next page you can write applicant so and respondent applicant the person who has filed the matter and respondent the person who is responding remember so these you know these are respondent and applicant name you'll get in your case law i'll share you the case law it's already uploaded on the website i'll tell you how to download i'll show you each and everything now next one is respondent presented by council so you are the council member you're the advocate so you're the council member respondent so you need to write your name here okay and then your council id again your council id you know because you haven't passed an examination which is required to become an advocate in India that is bar council examination so after that only you will get you know this ID council ID even we we conduct you know generally a test just after training but because of the time constraint we are not going to do that but maybe in future when you, you'll participate you know offline so maybe you'll have to go for it because we we try to complete all the procedure which is required so here you can randomly write any id number that we won't mind now then you have to last you know at last you have what I, you will have to do you have to write memorial on behalf of the respondent so in case if you're a respondent you have to write respondent in case if you are a petitioner applicant appellant you have to write that appellant but remember written submission by the respondent that is written there but written all the council members we are going to change your role when so maybe day one like one or two member can become a speaker and one or two member depends on group number six the total is strength you can form your group so one or two can become what researcher so in round one you can be like two can be the speaker and two researcher now next day in round two researcher will get chance to become a speaker and a speaker will get chance to become researcher so two rounds then third and fourth round you have to change your role so in case you're respondent then you have to become appealing in case if you are appealing then you have to become respondent so at that time I'll give you one day to prepare your memorial once again and change the content. Changing content means all these stuff. Got it. So when you are preparing your memorial, just be ready that you have to prepare both because you are going to represent both. You have to face, you know, same question. You have to ask maybe same question. So you'll have to play both the roles. Got it. So that's why you have to do, you know, accordingly your memorial. Any question, delegate?
I'm sorry, you're not delegate because you know I'm simultaneously I'm taking Moon Conference. So you're the council member. Okay, so remember when you are going to prepare your memorial. So now, if when you are participating, you know offline sessions. So at that time, you can submit your hard copy, which is not possible here. So what do you do? You know, first phase, digitally, you can make it blue or red. Take that color, fill it, or maybe take, you know, a, a piece and paste it simply in your, in your Word file, and then type it, the rest of the content. But, you know, cover should be blue or red, these two colors. So if it is blue, that means you have submitted memorial as an applicant. And if it is red, that means you're the respondent. Now, font and size, when you'll prepare, you know, all these. So font and size should be in general. Times New Roman. So, you know, when you're going to type it, just check out in your Microsoft Word. You know, these options you'll get or at least similar. Okay. And a space, lining a space and all these things you can check. Okay. Font and size, all these, you know, footnotes, line a space, page margin, you know, page setup, you can check out. So generally, uh, when we, can, we are conducting it offline, so we ask, you know, a student to use legal size paper, which is generally used in the code of law. But here you're using soft copy, you're going to submit soft copy. So please, at least you try to manage all these. In case if you fail in these guidelines, especially you know this one not others this guideline like somehow you're not able to take times new roman or maybe you know if it is not one inch on all side page margin so don't worry we are not going to deduct your marks uh, you can try to have this standard but don't worry like it is very hard and fast no. Okay. Anyone having any question related to this? Uh, sir, what do we have to write uh, in front of, in the matter of? Okay. Okay. Fine. Fine. So, like, today I'm not going to tell you what actually you are going to write. The reason behind it that I want first you to understand the case law, because if I'll tell you now you have to write this and that here and there, then again, you know, we have to come back what is actually there, you know, in case law. So first, I want you to understand, check out the sample, check out the original copy. Okay, and then later you can start writing. So. In your group number six, you can figure out, you can form a group, you can figure out who can be your group member. Okay, like in case uh, you do have eight members, so you can make it two plus two, two speaker and two researcher. In case you all are six, <clears throat> then you can make two plus one. Got it. So generally we give permission for two plus one, but in case if you do have, you can go with the two plus two as well. So figure out like in group number six, how we do have. And so in, we'll have two teams here in group number six and four rounds we'll have all together. 
so in a day two rounds like when you know <clears throat> when a speakers will become researcher in second round <clears throat> i'm sorry so so in a day two rounds so in all we'll have four rounds in case after two rounds if you want a gap i'll give you don't worry our sessions are having flexibility as for the students or participant so all the council members please do remember wherever you do have any kind of problem we try to shut out okay so remember this format and i'm going to share you know all these details in your whatsapp group so in case if you have any kind of problem you can check out once again now now <clears throat> what do you have to do the next thing is you need to visit on website i'm going to share a screen okay so this is the website worldeducationevents.com so normally it, it won't take you to the home page it will directly take you to the model un nation this page you need to click on mode code okay and then you can check out your rop number one you can download it so this is your rop number one what is important here we, we are going to check it out okay so this is about the eligibility and other criteria so no no need to do that registration already done okay now come to the next one okay oral pleading ground so the participant or the council member members are to appear for the oral round in a designated courtroom because we we do have offline session we don't have actually so it will be online and each contestant shall argue only once in oral pleading but remember remember i'm going to give you a chance like in case if you are a researcher so in second round i'm going to give you a chance to become a speaker so you can prepare for both the roles you know Generally, when we conduct it offline, when we do have so many students at that time, it becomes difficult. But here I'm going to I'm going to give you a chance so that you can experience as a speaker, you can experience yourself, your participation as a researcher both. Okay. Um, remember, you can be a plaintiff or respondent, but you are here a council member. So you're going to present plaintiff or respondent. So plaintiff means the person who has filed, you know, the matter in the court of law. Okay. Uh, just a second. Point. Oh, time duration. So it doesn't, uh, it doesn't matter because, uh, you know, because it's an online conference so you can it's not like 20 minutes we are going to give you but at least you should prepare uh, if you want you can prepare okay no no problem so you can prepare for first round like 20 minutes but divide you know that 20 minutes uh, among you know both the speaker or you, you can 
you can either decide like in case if you are having you know two plus one ratio so like when researcher will come so at that time you, you guys can discuss and I'll give you the permission so how it goes generally you know 20 minutes uh, you know council person can speak to explain what is tough they do have always remember you have to start with the basic points you have to explain each and everything it doesn't mean like you know you know you're going to skip some important points directly you can ask your judge to refer you know your memorial which is given on page number this and that this is how you can explain you can figure you know you can do research work related to the similar case laws and directly you can refer like this case law it happened this and that which is on page number this and that of your memorial okay so that it will help you know just to just figure out and verify this stuff okay and then last five minutes if a second uh, you know a last five minutes will be utilized for questions and yeah la uh, and then you know last two minutes will be used utilized for rebuttal okay i'll tell you about the rebuttal and all later so you can prepare at least for 20 minutes if you want if you want to adjust this time it's possible don't worry dress code so big is off uh, you know during training session you know no need to turn on your camera but of course when we'll have main session you know at that time you need to turn on your camera and it can it can be like an advocate a counsel person you know who goes into the code of law so maybe you can have a white shirt okay uh depends it should be formal in case if you don't have i won't mind it but you should look like an advocate presenting his or her matter you know in the code of law okay maybe black blazer will do uh rest you can you can understand like on camera or you know how to adjust so that that will be you know your dress code now the next thing is, is scouting is not required because we do have you know online session so it's not required yeah before going for the other point once again i would like to tell you in case you face any disconnection you need to utilize same link which is shared in your group until 9 or maybe till 8 50 at least we'll have our session now memorial written submission so remember uh generally you know uh, uh, when we do have offline sessions and when it goes you know maybe for a month at that time you have to submit a submit a very long memorial but here it's not required i'll, I'll show you the way it is written <clears throat> so you can finish minimum uh you know four to five or maybe six seven but not more than that okay not more than that in that pages you can adjust your stuff but generally when we are conducting it in law colleges so they have to submit you know they have to elaborate more more stuff they do have to do the research work so it can go up to pay 20 pages also so don't worry you can finish you know in short no need to submit hard copy please submit your soft copy okay you can decide you can discuss in your group you can decide your team okay and i told you about the blue and red color okay so this is important and i told you like you can um 
download this copy if you want from the website now come to the next one the next is rop number two you can download this one also i'm going to zoom it okay and here the key phrase is how you're going to you know speak because they are when you're participating generally in moon so you do have you know certain guidelines in the same way when you are going to participate in mood code again you have to follow certain guidelines uh, you know a few phrases you need to learn a vocabulary you need to encash so that you know it will help you to experience the real precision so maybe you can use you know this this is how the terms okay so here short forms are given so remember he it, that means you your lord okay uh your lady my lord my lady so this is how you're gonna start may it please your lord i'm so and so that means council person appearing on behalf of appealant i told you we do have appealant and respondent my learned friend mr so and so or whatever so you you can say master okay it's totally up to you or you can use title with mr okay will appear on behalf of the respondent so this is how these are the lines once I, I want you today to just go through it so that you know tomorrow you can ask your questions okay download it just figure it out what sort of vocabulary they have used what sort of you know phrases are given okay what examples are given I, today i want you don't worry like how to, when to start your memorial first you understand you know first you understand your concept all the points okay so all these points i want you to go through take your time we will adjust the date when to finish it okay but i want you to learn so some important website link is also given if you want to utilize it okay just go through these terms now come to the next point your case law so this is the case law you can take one or two days don't worry like it's not compulsory like tomorrow once again we'll have training session you take your time work as a team communicate with me i'll guide you i'll help you to understand so that the day you are going to face you know offline sessions you will enjoy it even you sh you you're going to enjoy this one as well if you are a voracious learner so here what we have done uh, all the council members please remember this is the original copy that we have done changes okay so whatever is written it's original it's original okay the final verdict we've taken now here you have to do certain changes when you will do drafting so maybe you can take you know mrs kapoor versus the state of bihar instead of the original name see original is some something different okay but in imc mood code you have to use this name mr kapoor okay original case is this okay petitioner Mr. Kapoor, respondent, state of Bihar. Okay, I told you the meaning of a state. So, if you are going to file a case law against a person, so you will get another person. But it was the mistake of authority, police department. I told you any university under government, I told you, you know, a state means what it can be uh you know uh, government institution so here who is responsible actually who is at fault police department that's why it is against state of bihar 
Now, which article you can mention here? So it is given Constitution of India, Article number 32, a scope of weather in a habeas corpus petition. Under Article 32, Supreme Court can grant compensation for def deprivation of fundamental rights. And one more thing, Constitution of India, Article 21, the scope of where covers right to compensation for its violation. Now, I, we have learned, you know, I told you Article 32 is the heart of Indian Constitution. So, as per Article 32, you can directly go to the Supreme Court. And as per Article 2 to 6, you can directly go to the Sup High Court. Got it? So, here just today, I want you to learn once again Article 32, Article 21. What is there in case if you have any kind of doubt, I'm available tomorrow again while I'll take your session. What is habeas corpus? Means you, when you're arresting someone, the person is in jail without any reason, or maybe if someone has completed his punishment, even after that, the person is in jail behind the bars. So you can raise, you know, your voice under this article. So I want you to learn what was the case law. Just go through it. What happened with that person? Why that person was in jail? Okay, just figure it out. Once again, we'll have discussion tomorrow, day after tomorrow, whenever you want. When each and every point is crystal clear with you, I'll tell you to start drafting your memorial. Please don't worry about when to draft. We don't have hard and fast, you know, time uh, schedule that you have. This is the deadline you have to do that. No. Okay. This is, is, is online session. So our intention is that you should learn. Okay. So please remember, what do you have to do? Maybe today, tonight, or maybe tomorrow. You first, you finish this one. What is given in this case law? Just read it out. Then I told you, like, you know, ROP2 and ROP1, you can download from worldeducationevents.com, go to the mood code, download these two, just read it out, try and understand. Okay. And uh, we can have more discussion. Any question so far, whatever we have covered? No? No, sir. Okay. So, it's a small session that we, we finished today. And I, I want you to read out Article number 21 and 32 of Indian Constitution. Also, Article 2 to 6 for your knowledge. And Article 12. Then, just download the PDF copies and the case law. Just try to understand what is happening there. Um, what does it mean by actual mood code? You mean your final? Uh, this, this one question actually. Okay, so once you are ready, just tonight you can start forming a group. You can discuss in, in your WhatsApp group, like who can be the researcher and all, your team. And once you are ready, I'll do that. I don't want to compel from my end. Okay, so just figure it out, start working. We'll fix the date, we'll finish it. Is it okay?
Okay, great. So thanks so much, everyone. In case you will have any kind of problem, I'm available. I'll respond. Maybe it will take time. Uh, when it, it will take time means what? Maybe spontaneously, maybe immediately I can't reply. But yes, I'll, I'll do that. I'll reply. Okay, you can directly send me messages or maybe in group. Thanks so much. All the best. And this recording will be available to you so that if you want to revise it, or those who joined us late, they can watch it. Thanks so much. Take care. Bye-bye and good night. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Bye-bye. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Bye.